Hello everyone, we've decided to show you the Quick Sale app and a couple of um, really easy to digest videos, um, a couple of different steps. So uh, if Seth could kind of take um, a walk around here, this is actually the um, my iPad app, uh, my iPad rather with all of my apps. Um, on the screen there you can see the Quick Sale app. I think it's worth noting people are always curious how other people sort of set up their apps and um, how they use their iPad. I have mine broken down into productivity folder, business folder, and so on and so forth. Uh, folders are designated by the black icons that you have here. So for the sake of um, what we're doing now, this, this um, demo, we're going to assume that you have uh, loaded or synced your um, your iTunes account to this iPad and that this tile, the quick sale tile, is popped up on your iPad. So the first thing that you're going to see when you hop on there is quick sale folks have been good enough to um, put some demo product in there um, and demo invoicing and such so that you can kind of play around with this. Um, I do want to point out in this just uh, step one and two video um, there's sales tab up here. Sales is where you're actually going to be generating your invoices. Uh, inventory is where you're going to be importing your inventory, SKU numbers and such. Over here is your history, really nice feature. A lot of people who use this, sales by month, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So as you use this over time, um, it will give you your history. Uh, over here, you what you need to do here is to put in your own company. Um, this is the demo company, but for example, Denise's Furniture has been loaded in there, so I've already popped in my own company, called it Denise's Furniture. Um, when you are completed doing whatever task that you are, it's always a good idea to either back this up to iTunes, send it in an email to yourself, or send it to Dropbox. And inevitably, you will need and want some help. The help section of this is really fantastic. Um, it's kind of where I taught myself how to learn this and with the help of some um, good friends out there uh, who return my desperate phone calls. So um, copy a quote, convert a pending to an invoice, email invoices, all of this kind of thing. And then the nav up here is inventory, history, backup, and restore. So um, what you've done here is we've kind of gone over what the inventory is. You've set up your own company. And in the next um, video, what we'll do is we'll show you how to import um, some of your product. And then in the third video, we'll show you how to generate an invoice. We'll be right back.